Well, hello, Liam. Uh, I'm glad to see your uh, summary 2.0. I think I responded to the first one as well. That was when I was first starting to respond to your videos. I've got to say, I think this summer has been one of my best summers too, because, I mean, I've done so many things. But beforehand, I like that your room is so bright, because look at my room. Like, that's the only light I have, and it's with the fan, and the quality of my video isn't that good, because I just use the one on my iMac iMac? MacBook. So yeah, I've done so many things. Like, uh, I volunteered at a summer camp for horse riding. That was fun. And I started growing some facial hair. Maybe you can see it. I've decided not to shave so I can look more mature. And act more mature. I actually did get a haircut recently, but uh, I didn't mention it in my previous videos. But if you look back in an older video, like the one I'm going to link back to up here maybe, you'll see I had longer hair back then. And the purpose of this video is to be the response to Summary 2.0. You had to know this was coming, right Liam? About you and Alex's albums, uh, I just downloaded your Unplugged album for free, and I'm currently about to download your other ones and actually pay for them. And the question, was it worth it? Was it all worth all this stuff? Definitely. If you believe that it's worth it, then it is worth it. And what did you do? You did that. And what did I do? Well, nothing. I spent my summer watching the three seasons of Game of Thrones, which is awesome. Peter Dinklage is the best. And what else did I do? I collected coins. Have them all rolled up here. I have $32 worth of coins in nickels and pennies and dimes. I mean, that's worth something. It's worth $32. It's worth more than what you made with your sales in profit. And I did see your video, The Final Vow, and I do know what it's like emotionally to leave Sentinel stage, because I did. I was like the same as you. I think I was involved in the same shows as you. Except Romeo and Juliet, because that one sucked. I hate Shakespeare. But it was great that you were in it. I support that. And I was also in Hairspray, remember? And I felt it. And then you were involved in Grease, and I'm glad you had fun and you enjoyed it. But in the end, the show was like the exact opposite of what I expected. It was turned into a kid's show. How did you let Pussy Wagon become... Dragon Wagon. Seriously, that's ridiculous. No. I went to Unplugged. That went really well. I made a response to Neon Vlog Freak's video about Unplugged, so you can watch that. I'm going to put the link to it here in this area somewhere. You should watch that, unless you already have. And just watch it again. Did I ever tell you that I like cats? It's my cat, Shadow. I'm glad that overall your summer did go very well and it was successful and stuff. My summer has been pretty average but fun and successful too with all of my uh, projects of doing nothing and starting to grow facial hair or uh, Facial pubes, as my friend Colton refers to them. So, I'm glad your phase is over. I guess technically my phase is over too, since I'm responding to yours. After you do your My Goals 2.0, I'll do my response with my goals, probably all university related, since I'm going to UVic and I'm never going to see you, since Victoria is like four hours away from Vancouver. Shadow, she kind of tingles when she purrs. It's kind of nice. And uh, thanks for thanking me there at the end. I really deserved that. Thank you. My summer, uh, pretty great. I enjoyed it. Probably not productive, as you might say. It's fun. Goodbye, Liam. <laughs>
<laughs> now I've got all this cat hair on me. You probably can't see it with the camera, but it's there. It's the problem with playing with pussy. You just get hair all over you. <laughs>